Arthur Arthur 120 millions Yeah. You haven't read the news? No. 120 millions, the first ever decentralized fund. What the hell are you talking about? It's, it's based on blockchain. Blockchain. Wait, wait, I can do this better. Blockchain. Magic. Yeah, no one, no one understands how it works. Nobody understands what it actually does, but suddenly it raised 100 million. Woo, we're supposed to care. Thank you. I mean, do, do you remember after the gold rush? After. No, but you don't understand the, the, the fact that it raised 100 million shows that people believe in a different way of doing things. You did invest. No. How much? 100. What? Euros. Oh. No, it, it's, it's, very, it's very easy, you know. It only took me two days. Uh, so first, I, I, I was able to buy Bitcoins. Huh? Then I, I, I changed my Bitcoins into... No, so I deposited my Bitcoins. Then I changed my Bitcoins into Ether. I was able to withdraw, to withdraw my Ethers. And finally, I changed my Ethers into DAO tokens. So now I'm part of this big DAO family. It's democracy, man. How can you not be inspired by that? Democracy. Right. You know, last time I checked, the French government just passed a very controversial bill about work without any vote from parliament. And uh, I think Donald Trump was said to be the Republican candidate for the US presidency, so <laughs> democracy these days. Pardon me, but a bit overrated, my dear. Justin Trudeau, this guy is inspiring. Yeah, he, he knows how to get likes on his Facebook videos. That's for sure. Uh, civic techs, they're, they're reinventing democracy all around the world, they're changing the way we, we relate to, uh, yeah, to the system. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a long road ahead. You know, I mean, can you quote one important policy that was implemented thanks to such systems? What about Mexico? They just crowdsourced its constitution. Uh, now? Uh, uh, not bad. Not bad. Not bad, okay. But, uh, okay, so. What, what do you propose, man? <laughs> Qu'est-ce que je propose What do I propose uh, why, do I, why should I every time uh, propose things It's not my thing. I mean, uh, okay, no, don't take it so seriously, man. I mean, easy, da easy, calm down. I mean, yeah, we run out of ideas. That's true. But good news is, you know, we gathered so many people for, to get new ideas. You know, for the next four days, they're going to talk together, build new models, find new ideas. I mean, fuel the engine again, you know, start a new world, hopefully. So it's not over. Well, it's not over yet. Guys, that's what you're here for, right? Woo! They're warming up, warming up. <laughs> yeah, I think we are in a pretty exciting moment here, which is uh, why you're all here for the next three days to help us figure out, after the gold rush, what are we going to make of this opportunity? What are we going to do with all the ideas we had, the things that maybe uh, when we were here three years ago looked a lot different, what can we actually uh, make as a next step together? Guys. Oh, okay. <laughs>